Divine Ones, we greet you, in love. We feel within you a growing awareness of the truth of your being. Your Divine Self is amplifying its presence within you each and every time, you invite that connection. Each time, you meditate, you expand your flow. Each time, you ask your Divine Self, all that you are, your Higher Self, to come more fully into your embodiment, it does so. Everything you ask for from within, from your heart, even as a feeling of desire, or longing, is then flowing to you and you are increasingly able to receive more of the energy that your eternal wholeness streams your way. And as this energy and light expands, so too, do you. Expand. Energetically and in consciousness. Your energy and your consciousness, are the lenses through which you have your experience and as these determinants of experience are elevating, you will find that your sense of the world opens up. As you pay more attention to your inner knowing, your inner connections. As you plan less, and push yourselves less, discovering that you can be easier about things, and instead simply tune in more and then go with the flow. You're discovering that you never needed to overwhelm yourself, motivate yourself, strive, or try to control things, and you've begun to relax. And this relaxation is so much deeper and so different than the way you might have thought about relaxation in the past. This is some deep and most beautiful connection with the totality of your being, that is arising within your embodiment as awareness. This is you discovering an inner sense of feeling safe. A sense of well-being that is deep and coming from inside you. One that is more steady and simple, and yet more of a surprise than most anything you can remember. It's subtle, but life-giving, this new gentle feeling of inner sanctity and refuge. It doesn't mean you do not have any fear, ever but alongside it there are now, moments in which you feel a much deeper sense of relaxation and ease and this is new. For a very long time now, human beings have lived their lives, running. Feeling threatened by the risks and dangers of being alive. They've learned to worry about things, to fear that the tenderness of their body and their heart, were not sturdy enough to handle what life would dish out. But this is not the case. In fact, it is your tender heart and your soft, vividly alive and vulnerable body, that give you so much sensitivity and so much potential for joy. Only through feeling so much, and being so aware could you learn to appreciate all the gifts that are here for you. For the same aspects of your awareness that used to be the way you picked up on threats and activated your nervous system, sounding the alert, are the same aspects of your sensory awareness and inner knowing that now are conditioning you to inner peace and well-being. It is these same sensory and translation capacities that now are picking up on a feeling of immense love and support all around you. You are evolving into a being that notices the subtle energy realms with as much naturalness and faculty as the prior version of your humanist noticed objects, things, smells and sounds. In the world in which you are living there have always been many many layers of living form and energy in the same space you are in now. If you were to pick up on all of it, you'd be overwhelmed, but you're not built that way. You're made to filter out and translate into experience things that are resonant with your energy field at this time, moment to moment selecting the similar energies and translating them, and this is your unfolding experience of life over time. But the difference is, now, you are so different, and increasingly so, energetically, and what you are translating. It's higher light. It's closer and more alike the divine plan than most of the past and your resonance is moving towards the divine perfection, a state of being in which you translate the singular flow of infinite light that is timeless and eternal, in each and every moment of earth-based experience. That is one way we might forecast what ascension is going to be like, for you. Smile. In the meanwhile beloved friends, know this, you're changing and as you change on the inside, what you experience in the world, and in your consciousness is also changing. What is seen and known and showing up as your experience, is elevated because you are elevating. More and more and more. Isn't it wonderful to have friends located elsewhere? Viewing things from high places, and who can shine a light upon the implications of even the most infinitesimal upleveling happening within you as you soften, let go more, believe more, and expect good things? Making peace within yourself is opening up more and more of the wonderful things that have always been here for you. And you perceiving them now? 
It's perfect. You're right where you are and it's wonderful. Just as it is. Know this. Always, know this. You are always, an expression of life, the divine perfection. You are never off track, everything is contributing to who you are becoming and what is becoming your unfolding life is endlessly enhanced by what you are creating in each previous moment and the consciousness that arises from the expansion and flow you are allowing. Or, we could say more simply, you are doing brilliantly. Feel it and smile. We are complete. I am Archangel Michael with the Council of Radiant Light.